And next here, I'm going to show you how to add storage for the system here. So you go and you choose storage. And then you look over here. You can see you have file storage, you have SAN, locals, file systems, shares, file systems. I'm going to just add an NFS server. And I'm just going to give it uh, my storage or my NFS. It's going to give it an IP address. Here. And next, let's choose a server which needs to be able to see the storage. Let's press next, and we'll discover the file server. Please, I have two here, which I'm going to add for my storage, and here. So now you can see your progress, file systems, have storage down here, you have ISO and server here. So I'm just going to rename uh, these, so press this one. I will rename this as being my, uh, instead of this name, I'm just going to give it my uh, uh, repository repository okay and I'm going to rename this one uh, you can either here or you can click up here so I'm going to edit this one uh, I'm just going to give it here my uh, server FS file systems. Okay, here. So now I have these two. Um, and we'll move on to the next step in the installation.